What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Daily Divers here with another episode of Dumpster Diving. Guys, we are at a new dumpster tonight. And first of all, I need to thank a subscriber. I'm sorry I don't remember your name, but someone emailed me, I think it was like a month ago, and said you need to go to Guitar Center because this person found so much freaking amazing stuff. They sent me pictures and all that. And finally, I'm around an uh, area where there is a Guitar Center, so super excited about this. There is some kind of amplifier or something inside here. I couldn't really tell what it was. I came here about an hour ago, but they were still open. I just want to take a quick peek and see if it was even going to be worth my time coming back. And there's actually something inside of here. I'm not really sure. I'm not too familiar about anything about musical instruments or anything about music in general, but still you guys can let me know in the comments. It's going to be pretty cool. New dumpster at least. And I'm sorry last night. It, so let's just face it guys. It's springtime. It's going to be raining more often than not. So I apologize. We're going to miss a few episodes here and there, but unfortunately our channel, um, it relies on the weather being good. And speaking of good, tonight is definitely a really good night to be out dumpster diving so we already went to a few places um, not a whole lot in there and if it was it was completely destroyed from the torrential downpours that we had so unfortunately we haven't found anything yet but I can tell you right now there's at least a couple things behind this door so that's pretty much it guys we are here at Guitar Center super excited about a new dumpster and we still got a few other places that we're gonna go to as well so hopefully we find some amazing stuff tonight and if you guys are new to the channel please make sure you subscribe and join the dumpster squad and give this video a thumbs up for Guitar Center Center, new dumpster definitely very cool so let's get inside of this dumpster guys just hop inside the dumpster guys let's go right for this amp really fast this is really interesting to me I'm trying not to fall there is like paint cans and paint buckets inside of here because there's a Sherwin Williams right next door so try not to get paint all over me all right so let's check this out oh what's heavy holy crap well it looks like it definitely has some age to it but I don't know. I don't know anything about this, guys. You can drop me a comment, obviously, and let me know if you know anything about this stuff, but it's called a Line 6 15 watt 6FX 8 inch custom speaker design. It's got all these, like, like I said, guys, I don't know anything about this stuff, but this is amazing. It looks like everything is there. Power button. Holy crap. It looks like everything is probably there. Um, it looks like, yeah, I need a power plug, power cord, hopefully we can find that, and I'm sure that's worth a couple bucks to somebody. We gotta find that power cord though. Look at these drums, or not drums, what are these called? Cymbals, I should say. You guys can tell I know nothing about this stuff, but this one is cracked. I'm not sure if any of these are worth any money at all. This is maybe like a cushion for a chair. Look at all these symbols though. They're all busted up. Somebody beat the heck out of them. Um, I'm not really sure if these are going to be worth anything. Probably not. Yeah, these are not going to be worth taking because you can see they're all busted up. Definitely the amplifier so far. And there's like some kind of like stands for probably drums over there. I don't know. We just got to keep checking. Here's like some kind of harness something like that what is this oh that's like a bag there is some kind of oh this is a guitar strap made in the USA freaking sweet definitely gonna take that I'm super excited about this guys never been inside this dumpster I always get excited for new dumpsters and here's a box for and nah, that's not in there but that was uh, some kind of thing I think it was a pedal for a guitar this is empty. All right, so it looks like we probably just got a few stands. This one is humongous. It does have some duct tape around it, so that's probably why they threw it out. But I don't know, guys. You gotta definitely help me out with this because I don't know if I can maybe sell some of this stuff at a yard sale for like real cheap or I don't know, maybe just scrap it. I have no idea. Still worth taking to me, but definitely drop me a comment about this. I'm not sure what this is. Is this maybe for a mic? Not really sure, guys. Sorry, I know nothing about this stuff, but of course I'm going to share this experience with you. And I got one. No, we got a couple more stands over here. All right, this got a better look at this one. This is called Enforce. I think it says made in the USA too. It's pretty nice. I mean, obviously it's very aged, <laughs> but still pretty cool nonetheless. I'm just not sure exactly what these stands go to. Is this for a drum? That's what I'm thinking, but not 100% sure. We got another stand right here. 
and that looks like it's probably pretty much it guys I'm definitely definitely going to take this amp and the strap and I'm probably going to take the like the other two small stands not sure about this one though what do you guys think probably gonna leave this here though just because it's probably not worth a whole lot of nothing it's got duct tape around it it looks like it's probably been broken and all these symbols uh, they might be worth their weight in scrap metal so I might take them for that but other than that they're not worth anything. Anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. That's pretty cool. We found a freaking amplifier. But I'm just going to go ahead and load this stuff up inside the car, guys. And I'm going to move on to the next dumpster. All right, guys, we're over here at Alta. I can't talk very loud just because there's a lot of people out in the parking lot still. I don't want to get caught over here and get banned. But anyway, let's go through some of these bags. There's a couple bags over here. But a lot of this stuff looks like it's the same from the other day. But anyway, let's go through some of these bags. This looks like it's, yeah, that, that was empty. Oh, here we go. Oh, Nicole, this bag, it's got stuff in it. Oh, yeah, there's makeup in here, guys. Put it down. Be careful, I think it's like leaking a little bit. I felt like there was definitely something in some of those boxes. Yes, there was. I'm telling you, I felt makeup. No, these are the caps in here. Like the papers. Oh. Uh, what about these? They're all empty? All empty. Are it's you kidding display. me? No, it's for displays. Oh, well, that was an epic fail. <laughs> it was just a cap inside there, guys. Sorry about that. That's something new. Anything is inside of here? You guys hear me sniffling a lot i do apologize my allergies are absolutely terrible i'm sure some of you feel my pain <laughs> there might be a couple bags over there on the other side light bulbs inside of this box oh i <laughs> just just hit the camera with a light bulb what about this bag here Ooh, might be something in here actually there we go i don't think it's a whole lot but it looks like there's something in there Oh, is that full? Or is it empty? Oh, it's full. Yeah, it's what is it? It's a whole lipstick. Why don't you show the camera? That's the whole purpose of making a video. It's actually a pretty decent No one can see what brand it is. It's by Benefit. Benefit, okay. Is there any more in there? Anything else? Oh, there's another one. Two more. Oh, there's two more? Yeah, this one's. Oh. It's missing the cap, but that's okay. That's alright. So you got four of them? Oh, there's the oh, cap. Okay, yeah, there's the cap right there. I thought I saw it. And I think that's actually it. So, how many did you got so far? Four. four. I'm pretty sure that's probably it. Let's throw this back in. Everything else seems like it's the same from the other day in here. Yeah, guys, this is it, at least for Alta number one. We might get to another one later, but that's going to be it for this Alta. At least we got a couple things here. Anything inside of Bed Bath & Beyond tonight? Not looking too good. Actually, there might be a bag right there, Nicole. Looks like it possibly has something in it because I see some of the return slips on there. Mm -hmm. Let me jump in really quick. And... <laughs> and I don't think there's actually anything in here. Maybe. Maybe. Huh? I don't think there's anything in here. I think, think it's a bunch of just random return slips. Us. When you see these, it usually means there's something, but apparently not today. Is there something in there? It's out of this box, maybe? This bag, I should say. What is this? That's a soda stream refill, but it's empty. Anything in here? Just broken up glass. All right, well, unfortunately, that was a waste of time. Nothing inside of Bed Bath & Beyond tonight, guys. So about an hour later and about 10 dumpsters later, we are not having a whole lot of luck at all. But to end the episode off on a good note, we are at a Toys R Us. If you guys can see the back door right over there. You guys already know all the Toys R Us's are closing down and they just put this dumpster here. It had to have been the last couple days. I haven't been back here in a couple days, but they had to just put it here because maybe four days ago I was back here and this dumpster was not here. As you guys can see, see 
there's not a whole lot of stuff inside of here I mean I did take a quick little look around everything is like old shopping carts but I can guarantee you one thing is they're going to throw something out soon so before the store closes I can just about guarantee you that we're gonna find something awesome inside of here so super stoked about this dumpster but like I said we went a bunch of other dumpsters tonight and fortunately everything is either soaking wet and flooded or there's just nothing in there but we did found a few things anyway guys we found a new dumpster tonight so that's a good thing and I enjoy hanging out with you guys regardless so stay tuned for my hand keeps on getting in the way stay tuned for Toys R Us so that's what this dumpster is going to be we're going to definitely have to check back on this but anyway guys that's pretty much going to do it for tonight's episode thank you all so much for tuning in today if you guys are new to the channel as always make sure you smash that subscribe button and join the dumpster squad and I will see you guys tomorrow with a new episode. Yeah.